wire everywhere. Hello there. Right, some high tech music. Two Echo Zero Tango Whiskey Golf Portable. Hi, it's Tim, 2E0 Tango Whiskey Golf on the south coast of England, saying hello to you. And this is the final instalment. If you like a, a conclusion or a summary of the linear loaded uh, videos that I've been doing over the past few weeks, what I've been aiming to do, of course, is use some ladder line, 450 ohm ladder line, to try and shorten the length of an antenna that you can use for different, uh, different frequencies. And if you remember, what we've been doing is shortening the ends of the 450 ohm ladder line together so we have two wires coming back down with one wire connected to the centre of the antenna. And we do that on both legs. And uh, yeah, it's been a fun experiment. Some good stuff's come out of it. We managed to make a short antenna for 40 metres. It's worked really, really well. And converted it into a doublet, which has worked 80 metres for the first time at my QTH. So I'm really happy about that. Uh, we've also made a shortened antenna for 40 metres to work as a vertical, a quarter-way vertical, that we've taken portable. So it's been good fun. Uh, there are pros and cons to linear loading, but the bottom line is if you haven't got the space for a full-sized antenna, it's an option you could look to do. Anyway, uh, the following slides will provide you with suggested lengths for each uh, dipole to be resonant on for different frequencies. Also some uh, formulas, or formulae I suppose is the correct plural, for you to look at as to how to work out uh, the resonant length for a two-wire version and of course the three-wire version which incorporated the wire running through the centre of the two conductors that we've just described. If you're not sure about what I'm talking about, if you haven't watched any of them before, have a look at the videos that I've got listed underneath this video and they're in, in, the, in the order that they were actually released for linear loading. And I've also put all my linear loading uh, videos into a playlist. If you want to have a look at that, then feel free to browse and uh, ask any questions at any time in the comments section below each video. Okay, without much further ado then, uh, enough rabbiting from me. Uh, here is basically the, uh, the slides showing these lengths and how to work them out. And uh, I wish you now 73, have a look through them and pause them if you need to. But 73, good to have you on board. Remember to subscribe, click the bell button as well if you have subscribed to know when I've released a new video. Good to have you on board guys and uh, thanks for watching the video. And uh, hopefully the following few slides will make some sense. 73 and uh, good luck with your antenna experiments too. Bye bye.